Hi. Um, my name is uh, 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 Wayne Kerr. I'm, I'm here to just introduce myself a little bit today. <coughs> and I, I'm going to start off by saying that uh, I'm 17 years old. I grew up in Compton, California. <coughs> I started my career a couple years ago. I, I started out um, as a janitor at a local school, but um, I ended up becoming a, uh, a teacher, I guess you could say. I, I help out with the special, the special ed kids. <coughs> For some hobbies, I like to, I like to go bike riding with my, uh, with my family. <coughs> I, uh, I also like ice fishing. I prefer open water over ice, though. <coughs> I usually have a, a better, better chance of catching fish that way. I prefer boxers over briefs. <coughs> I, I do, I did, I did drive a car. <coughs> I, I ended up getting my license taken away for, uh, for life, I I had some accidents uh, with the police here. Uh, first, it first started with a, a couple minor incidents. I uh, I did hit a cat, and I killed it. I realized I killed it, so I brought it to. Uh, I mean, I just assumed where it lived, so <clears throat> I brought it up to the doorstep, and I I left a note. Um, I'm not gonna go into detail on what the note said, but. I just, I just said sorry for their loss. I happened to be driving through a heavy populated neighborhood. It was around 8 p.m. Uh, it was dark out. I, I did drive up onto the sidewalk, and I did hit a small child, uh, approximate age seven or eight. I, I did speak with the family. Um, they did file a lawsuit against me. Uh, I truthfully didn't think that it was very bad. I mean, it was just minor injuries, uh, broken back, broken leg. The police had just had a complaint about eight hours prior. I, uh, I killed a cat. Um, that was on my record. Uh, <clears throat> Now this was on my record. I did go to court, and like I said, I have I have my license taken away for life. Um, I had to sell my car. My my favorite restaurant would probably be uh, uh, <clears throat> Chuck E. Cheese. I I like uh, when you go in. I like that they give you a glow in the dark stamp on your hand. And I, I really like the atmosphere in there. Um, it makes me uh, makes me happy to hear all the kids having fun. Um, the food is it's it's really good. <coughs> uh, a lot of people ask me this question. Uh, I always answer, of course I'm not a virgin. Um, <coughs> I mean. I work with little kids, come on. Jeez. I like I like the idea of hunting. I I also like the sport of trapping. And I tend to I tend to put those together in one to, into one sport activity. <coughs> and what I do is I I trap raccoons. And once I trap them, <coughs> I let them go and hunt them, and I'll tell you, I will kill them. <coughs> Another question I get pretty often is, uh, do I like cats or dogs? I answer truthfully, and I'm not allowed to own either of them, but I do own goats. I've been abducted three and a half different times by three different spacecraft <coughs> on my half time I only got half a pickle in my ass what is my favorite activity <coughs> I like sledding 
I'm not a love expert or anything, but do you think we can love someone who loves another? <clears throat> Truthfully, yes. I I love my goats, all five of them, and I I love my girlfriend. Um, I love chocolate. Too. Um, some people, well, I mean, while we're on the topic of love, some people ask me what true love is. True love is your soul's recognition of its counterpoint in another. <coughs> My favorite childhood memory was when I learned how to go sledding. I, I went, I went over, uh, to my backyard, and my my dad was uh, he was shoveling, and what I did was I uh, I took I took my new sled I got for Christmas, and I put it on top of the snowbank, and uh, he gave me a push. I <clears throat> I went down so fast and ever since then all I do is sled I really like that my dad was the one who gave me the push to learn how to properly sled my worst childhood memory was uh, it was probably the the year that I, I burned down our Christmas tree it was an accident <clears throat> I, I also burnt a hole in the side of our house my parents weren't very happy with me. Uh, I I didn't get coal for Christmas because they figured I'd burn that too. So uh, <clears throat> they gave me sand. Uh, that's all I got. My idea of a perfect girl is uh, somebody who who likes to have hot tub sessions. Uh, they allow me to use their hot tub whenever I want. Uh, they bring me sandwiches whenever I want. Uh, they let me have a man cave. Uh, they bring me beer, cigars, really whatever I want. Uh, they, they just need to be an all-around good person but definitely someone who lets me use their hot tub I prefer white meat over dark meat I'd rather have potted plants rather than naturally grown from the ground I prefer stiff mattresses over soft mattresses so there's this girl that I uh, I really like and I don't know how much she likes me back. I uh, I want to make this work, but I don't know. I don't know how she feels. I uh, I was with her once and I I messed up. I, uh, if you're if you're listening to this right now, I uh, I want to make it work. So stop kissing kissing the OT boys. And uh, you should really let, let some bros use your hot tub. <laughs>